good. I forgot to hit record. That's what you're okay. Say. okay. Do that surprisingly a lot considering I film a lot of videos. Here we go again. We are driving to Yellowstone National Park. The winter has become my favorite time to visit the park because it's just so much less crowded. So we got up early this morning and we're almost into town. I'm gonna grab some food and then head into the park and hopefully see some animals. Ooh, there's the Yellowstone sign. Missed it. just got into the park and already I'm looking at some bighorn sheep. There's a huge ram and it is incredible. So last year when we came here in the winter, we didn't see any bighorn sheep. So <laughs> this is very exciting. Far. Oh, he's running. So far today has been a bighorn sheep day <laughs> and I'm not mad about it. It's so incredible. There's at least eight of them over here on this hillside. in Lamar Valley and we've seen some bison, not actually as many as I would think because I've been through the Lamar Valley so many times over the years and there's always like hundreds of bison. But we've only seen, you know, a handful or so. There's one way over there. I don't know if you can see him back there, but they're around. They're just sitting in the snow. <laughs> Doesn't seem like they care about anything. <laughs> It is seriously so, so beautiful though. Like the snow and the quietness. No, I can't see anything. Stop it. What's it look like? Just, just see, like, like darkness? White just like slowly start to creep up. There are a lot of bison out there, like a lot of them.
day two in the park and it is snowing. <laughs> and we are, uh, Nick's taking some photos. We were driving along the road and I see a little, a young bison, like a yearling. And I was like, oh, let's stop, let's look at him. It's kind of weird that he's all by himself. And we were just like looking at him. And then Nick was like, wait a second. <laughs> There's a ton more right next to him and they were all just laying down buried in snow and we literally didn't see them. There's one, two, three, four, five other bison right next to the young one that we just, I just thought they were rocks. <laughs> so it's just crazy seeing them like this in the snow because last year there was snow but it there was not fresh snow so this is definitely new for us but yeah, just hilarious. We both just didn't even see bison right on the side of the road because they were covered in snow. Clearly, visibility is rapidly decreasing. So I think this is as far as we're gonna go because you can't really see anything because of the snow. And then we're gonna slowly start to make our way back out of the park and see what we see. If you're five minutes earlier, five minutes later, your experience could be totally different. What are you doing? Keep thinking. We're out of the, the snow, but there's still very low visibility. So we're just gonna stop at this overlook and we're doing crossword puzzles. <laughs> Cause we have a lot of time in the day and um, you know, we're gonna kind of see if things change a little bit and then maybe on our way out, we'll see different animals or- John. All right, give me a clue. Office, Office leader. leader, CEO. <laughs> Wait, I didn't see what the how, four across. How many is it? See, oh, that doesn't fit there. Office leader, boss. Ships, staff, crew. What else could it be? Mate. It could be crew. It could also be mast. But I'm not gonna write anything in pen until I know for sure. Thirty-three down. Took a chance. a chance on you. Dun, 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 dun. Yeah, a, um, take a chance on me. Dun, dun, I know dun, what 32 dun, down dun, is. Wed quietly. Elope. Right? Mm -hmm. 32. Mm -hmm. Take a chance on me. Tossed dish. <laughs> what? With an L and a D. Salad! <laughs> Look, it's cleared up a lot, actually. I know, you can see the snow falling on the trees over there. We should make some coffee now. I think it doesn't seem too windy either. We are going to make a little bit of coffee and some breakfast. So I brought maple and brown sugar oatmeal, which I don't know if we're going to have that yet. I have some really good lemon poppy seed muffins that we've been eating and an apple. So Nick is outside right now, braving the cold, boiling some water. So I'm going to go out there and help him because I feel kind of bad. <laughs> we're just sitting in the car.
It looks so... <laughs> To round out the day, we are taking a magical walk here among the terraces. Gonna look at some of the geothermal features here and just, yeah, walk around a little bit before we sit in the car for a few hours and drive home. But I just love when there's fresh snowfall and there's snow all over the trees and it's so quiet. steam now and it smells like sulfur <laughs> it's so cool seeing this in the winter because it's just different i've seen it in the summertime and something about the snow and the steam the contrast of everything it's just pretty cool i've reached the end of the boardwalk Look at these trees. There's so much steam coming off of the hot springs. It's creating basically snow on every little <laughs> inch of this tree. Oof, there's that steam and that sulfur. <laughs> it stinks right now. It smells like rotten eggs. This is just really cool. <laughs> My face is so cold that I'm having a hard time talking to you. <laughs> I'm gonna go catch up with Nick and then we are gonna start the drive home for a few hours. Um, yeah, such a fun Yellowstone trip. Very different than the experience we had last year in the winter, but that's just kind of the fun of it. You know, you never know what you're gonna see, what you're gonna find and yeah, it's been a good time. <laughs> See you guys in the next one.